see you this morning. Good morning, by the way. I've come up Mount Bellis, which is to the north of uh, Lake Kirkini, for some landscape photography. At this time of year, when we get really cold mornings, there's a lovely fog that lies over the lake, and it makes for some stunning images as it, as it pours through the trees. And that's what I'm hoping to get this morning. There's a little bit of fog down there and mist. But the most of what you see on the horizon along here um, is smog caused by farmers burning the stubble in their fields. So despite that, I'm hoping that the sun, which is going to break through up there very shortly, um, will still give us a beautiful sunrise and the low light will cut through the trees with the, with the um, mist and the trees and the colors of the autumn and hopefully should make some for some lovely images. Just to give you a quick orientation of where we are. Um, this is the entire valley below with a lake on it. You can see right there. And this silver line that you see along here, that is the river Strimonas, which is the main river supplying the lake with water. And that river runs all the way through to Bulgaria, so the water comes down from Bulgaria into this lake. And as you see the line, you know, if you can make it out, the line up here, down here, and it goes right down into the, into the middle of the lake, and either side of it, is the forest where in the summer all the um, birds nest, uh, the cormorants, the herons, the egrets, spoonbills, an amazing variety of birds, glossy ibis, um, and the pelican platforms are to the right. So this is where we are this morning. So I've just got the final few tweaks before the sun does come up. I've got to get my um, cable release out. And um, hopefully we'll get some nice pictures this morning. Okay, so I'm just trying to set up the camera. Focusing in the fog is really hard. So I'm struggling to get focus. I'm having to... Because there's so little contrast in the scene. So what I'm doing is focusing on the on the shine of the water to try and give me that um, point at which I can gain focus. Okay, so I'm going to spin you around and so you can see what I'm seeing. So quickly off the back of the camera, this is the, this is what I'm seeing. That's my composition, and then if you look, the sun is uh, preparing to come out on the horizon over there. If I just zoom in onto the lake, so you can see what I'm talking about. So you see the, even this camera is struggling to focus on the river. That's it. You can see as the mist comes through the trees. It's quite stunning. It's 7.15 right now. And um, the sun is supposed to rise at about 7.23. But with the mountain in the distance there, it'll probably take a little bit longer than that. Now. Okay, it's absolutely incredible. The sun is just about to break over the mountain and it is just absolutely gorgeous. Just a red ball of fire just creeping up over the mountain. I'm going to try and zoom you in on this camera so you can 
have a look. Absolutely stunning, stunning, stunning. Have a look at this from the back of the camera because it's not going to work to zoom in. Just the most glorious sunrise. It's the effect of the um, the smoke from the burning fields that has created a screen and the sun just appears red like that. Absolutely stunning. As the sun rises, it should um, cast more light through the trees, hopefully adding a little bit more contrast to the scene, which will help make things a bit clearer and sharpen focus even more. So, yeah, I'm just waiting for the sun to hit the trees now. So it's got to come slightly higher above the mountain to do that. to get a couple of good images. I think the sun, because of the smog, it throws uh, not at full brightness, which meant that the light hitting the trees wasn't at the lowest level it could be uh, to give that extra contrast, to give the, to backlight the trees and make them stand out more from the fog. So, um, but that being said, we did get an amazing, amazing sunrise. So I'll um, process the pictures and um, see what we can come up with. And hopefully I'll be showing you in a second some decent photos. So I'll catch up with you later. Cheers. <laughs> 